Welcome to the Modular Clubhouse and in today's video we're going to be looking at the noise engineering plugin beta. So this is a collection of three plugins that you can use in your door of choice and they are giving it out for free. So I had a quick look and I want well I want to share that with you guys in order to well, persuade you to all go out and grab them because they're phenomenal. And uh, what you need to do is you need to go to uh, noiseengineering.us. Uh, make sure that you either already have a, a customer portal account or create one. And once you do that, you can download the um, noise engineering installer, which looks like this. And that will help you with installing the actual plugins. So the plugins that are included are two instruments and one effect. So the effect is the Ruiner, which is of course the same uh, code that we know from the Ruiner Versio, which is the well, the equivalent in Eurorack. And we have two instruments as mentioned. One is the Sync Vario, uh, which is based on the Sync Eater from uh, from years past, uh, and it's a module that is well, depending more on the wave morphing and wave folding. And there is a lot of things that you can do there. I'm going to show those in a in a few seconds. And the second instrument is the Vert Vario that has three well algorithms built in. Uh, one is called Bass, and the other is a Saw X, which is a Super Saw, and Harm, which is more additive, uh, based on additive synthesis. So uh, without further ado, let's uh, have a quick look. So I'm going to be using Ableton, but as you know, the same thing will work in your door of choice. Um, if you do run into any challenges or problems, um, please reach out to Noise Engineering. They are looking for feedback. That's why they're running this beta program, of course. I haven't run into any sort of problems, and it's an extremely polished set of plugins that they've delivered. So uh, no worries there whatsoever. So let's start with the uh, Sync Vario first. So I'm just going to drag that in. I'm not going to bother you with uh, my well, <laughs> with my well playing skills. So I've got Clemens Vias's MIDI file lo uh, loaded already. So let's uh, give that a try. And um, what you see here is of course, so this is the sync Vario. So this has got the uh, the well the more wave shaping capabilities where you can immediately start to see how you can go through these very well, descriptive wave shapes and you've got three main algorithms noise, plane and super so plane is as you can see a more wave folding approach and if you go to super there is also a little wave folding happening there but there is more detail in the actual wave so there's a lot of things there so if you are like me and you don't really know what you're doing uh, there are a, a, a couple of dozen of presets that come with the plugins so I would always recommend to uh, give those a try they are phenomenal and what you can always do is give it a slight nudge which will slightly change the, the settings. And that is of course great when you're just discovering how this plugin works, what you want to do with it. Or if you're looking for that sound and you're not just quite there yet, you can of course also randomize all the settings, which is uh, quite nice. There is some configuration that you can do one of the th nice things is that you can easily change the colors of the of the plugin configuration make it bigger or smaller and you can add fire to the mix which is of course just neat to see and you can add as much fire to it as you want if you want none just right or too much i like that noise engineering did this it just it adds to the whole noise engineering feel of it. And you have your uh, your MIDI cheat sheet where you can change your MIDI CC changes. 
so it's a this makes it that much easier so if you've got a uh, a MIDI controller with a lot of knobs you can just make sure that you have all control that you want I just love this so how about we just grab some Ruiner and throw that in the mix so the Runa interface is almost exactly the same as the Syncferio one. Of course, you've got different settings there. Uh, config and MIDI. And of course, also Runa comes with a set amount of uh, presets. Um, so I'm going to select the first preset. Don't be alarmed. This is how the presets sound. <laughs> I love the the grit that this has. So let's start with a clean sound and then start playing with it. This just sounds like a way overdriven guitar. I love it. been thinking about getting a Runa Versio but after hearing this effect I'm sold I'm ordering that ASAP once the the funds allow it because this is just great you can do so many great things with it and it's got a setting called doom what else do you want it is just a a superb effects module uh, sorry, uh, an effects plugin, of course, based on an effects module or vice versa. Because, of course, the Versio platform is, of course, a, uh, a programmable platform where you can, of course, switch all of the um, uh, the Versio firmwares. So you can have your Ruiner Versio or you can then swap that for the, for the delay. Um, I'm, I forget how they are called, of course. But... The, 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 the actual firmware is of course comparable to what you can see here in the actual plugin. So that's of course, that's a great thing. So we've looked at the sync uh, Vireo, we've looked at Ruiner, so let's uh, have a look at the third, the third Vireo. So I'm just gonna replace the sync Vireo and we still have Ruiner running, but we're not doing anything with that. So. Here we have the three algorithms. So you've got your bass algorithm, your saw, and your harm. And you can of course start playing around with these shape. And as with the others, you have a, well, several dozen presets that you can loop through. Let's add Runa back to the mix. I love this. 
this. It is such a rich palette that you can use to start painting your new sound designs with. I, I truly am impressed with the quality that is already in this beta. And then, as you know, the beta can only get better and you already have all of this richness in there. So I think that everyone should grab these these plugins, uh, whether you're a you're a hardcore door user already, or if you're uh, just stepping into working with the door, give this a try. And if you're running your Eurorack system, go th and send it through Ruina, see if that's for you as well. I just love these 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 plugins and. Yeah, they make me fall in love with noise engineering again, and that's of course one of the main reasons why I think that they've released these plugins to get people hyped about the plugins that they are developing, all of the other things that are coming from from noise engineering, and I can only applaud this initiative to uh, make this a public beta. So that being said, I would say, well, everyone stay safe, stay healthy, and I hope to see you for my next video. Cheers.